Some of you may already know that years ago, I was a young college leftist. And like all the other godless college leftists, I would go to many unsavory parties. That was until one evening. While I was at one of these parties, I eventually passed out from the constant drinking, dancing, and premarital sex. When I woke up, something felt wrong. The girl next to me felt something wrong, too. Everyone else in the room noticed something wrong. That's when I realized the left had pooped in my pants. I was confused. Why would the left do this? They were supposed to be friendly and tolerant to everyone. So why would they then go and poop in my pants? It was at that moment that it all made sense to me. The left were actually Nazis. But not just any Nazis. Poop Nazis. And they were coming for your fresh underwear. I knew then that I could no longer be a leftist and that I had to begin my fight to stop the left and prevent it from pooping in anyone else's pants. My first act to take away the left's power over me was to shit my own pants. I've never felt more free from the left's power than when I take a big stinky poo-poo in my pants. That was my first realization of the importance of urine and feces in our fight against the left. If the left is to be defeated once and for all, and the people are to be freed from the Marxist Nazi poop regime, they must all start by pooping in their pants. I'm Dennis Pricker. To help keep these videos free, please consider shitting in your pants.